Hello everyone, welcome to Anonymous World. Hope you are doing well. So in this video, we will see about a uh, face recognition tool and a reverse in, uh, image search tool known as PMI. So let's get started. Before getting into the video, a huge shout out to Aman Mishra and Itachi Uchiha for joining the membership of my channel. So now let's get started. Okay, so let's see about a face recognition tool uh, known as PMIS. Okay, so PMIS is a face recognition search engine and a reverse image search tool. Okay, so uh, in this website, you can simply upload your photo and uh, you can find out where the images are published. Like if you upload a picture of a particular person, then it will uh, scroll all, all over the internet and see if it and see if that person's picture is available on the internet elsewhere. Okay, anywhere else. Okay, so then it will uh, give you the uh, list of all the uh, similar images. So uh, it is not a 100% accurate tool. So it will uh, give you uh, images of other people who have who has resembling faces okay uh, okay so it is an online face search engine that goes through the internet to find pictures containing given faces and it uses face recognition search technologies to perform a reverse image search okay as i told you now so uh, you can use it for OSINT purposes or investigation purposes or just for finding uh, someone in the internet so uh, again a disclaimer it is just for education purpose and nothing uh, nothing for malicious, malicious intention so I don't recommend or encourage you to use it for uh, any harmful means like stalking someone or doing something else okay so this is just uh, for uh, educational purpose so uh, simply click on upload photos you have two options either you can upload a photo or you can just click a picture from your camera okay so first uh, let's try it on a famous person so let's say i have an image okay so it says try to upload a better quality image or add more photos to get better search result so you can add uh, four to five photos or two, three, two to three photos of the same person so just check all the boxes then you have two more options safe or safe search and deep search so these two options gets enabled when you have the premium version of this tool by default and for free users it does not allow deep searching okay and there and you get uh, 10 free searches so let's start search let's see if it finds something searching for images okay so can see it found uh, found out few images and uh, uh, anything else uh, associated with that image or text uh, uh, gets blurred out so you can see there is some uh, another person there is another person too so it's not a 100% accurate tool and uh, there were some extra text uh, with this picture so that's all got blurred you can see another person here but it's blurred so you can see it's from some news website maybe seven results three results and it also gives the link of that particular place of where the photo was published okay Shahrukh Khan keeps coming up don't know how their faces resemble so okay pretty much you got the idea how it uh, works so let's try this on uh, another photo. I will use my own photo. Let's see. So this tool can be helpful and dangerous at the same time. Imagine someone using uh, your picture and trying to find out uh, other pictures which are posted uh, anywhere else on the internet which you don't want to see. Which you don't want anyone else to see. Okay, let's see. I have my photo here. Uh, so basically it can be used to uh, gather uh, photos of a particular person which can be used for stalking or uh, some other purpose keep that right so this is my photo uh, start searching okay let's see okay the first photo yeah, this photo is mine it's on linkedin i guess 
let's see if it uh, got any more photos of mine okay yeah this one is also mine this black and white one i i think i uploaded it on instagram but my account is private i don't know how it got that too that's pretty crazy okay let's see if uh any other photo of mine is there uh i don't see any other photo so uh, let's see let's add uh, two three photos of mine then we can try if it gives some extra this one photo let's add more photos okay let's see how uh, we can add more photos too but uh, let's continue with two i don't think i have any other photos i know my computer right now Okay, so and again, it gave those two photos from earlier. Yeah, so doesn't give any more photos. Okay, let's try it uh, one last time on someone else. So this is a photo of, of a friend of mine. He also has a YouTube channel known as Ethical Empire. Uh, must must check out that. See. Okay, the first photo. This is him. There are not much result. Also, he's not that much active on social media. I mean, he is, but not with photos and stuff, you know. So let's click on the photo and see what uh, other options are there. So there are, are options for uh, opening the website to see where the image appears. Open the image with uh, unblurred version. Perform search with this image. Copy result ID. Exclude from public resource. Okay, so uh, uh, let's see. So these options are paid. You need to pay them to use this extra premium features. Okay, so nothing will open here. Okay, this one is opening. Okay, so basically, for on the option perform you know, search with this image, that image will uh, will be the input of for for your next search. Let's try the, this. We already clicked there yeah so there are no more photos of him at least not for them eyes okay so uh, that was pretty much for this video and uh, again i i am telling you that please don't is uh, don't use it for uh, any money share purposes or with the intention of harming someone or stalking someone uh, it's completely your responsibility so that's it for this video. Till then, keep learning.